Hi, I'm Dr. Willie Ong. For today, I would like to share some tips on how to prevent HIV AIDS. Acquired Immune Deficiency Syndrome or AIDS is a disease caused by the HIV virus. The disease starts as an HIV infection wherein the patient still feels healthy. However, after several years when symptoms occur, the disease is now called AIDS. Now, this deadly HIV virus can be transmitted in several ways. It can be transmitted by sex in 80% of cases, by IV drug use, dirty needles, by the mother to her child during childbirth, and transfusion of contaminated blood products. To prevent HIV, you should remember your ABCs. A is for abstinence from sex. That's the best way to prevent HIV transmission. Now, if you cannot abstain, you go to B. Be faithful to your partner have a monogamous relationship. Now, if you can't be faithful, you go to C, which is to use a condom correctly at all times. And D, don't share needles. This is a sample of an HIV virus. And uh, we must also not discriminate on patients who are HIV positive. Therefore, HIV can't be transmitted by kissing, handshake, sharing living quarters, or eating with an infected person. Now, I would like to show you a table showing the different kinds of sex act and the risk involved. The highest risk comes from anal sex because of mucosal and skin pair during the sex act. This is followed by regular sex wherein there is still a risk and lowest in risk is oral sex. Therefore, for all kinds of sex act, the person must use a condom at all times to be protected. Okay. I would like to give a short tip on how to use a condom correctly. Condoms have an expiration date. When you open it, open it with your hands. Don't use a scissor, you might cut it. And the basic principle of condom use is that there should be no skin contact between the male organ and the female organ. There should also be no contact between the fluid of the male organ and the female organ. So how do you do that? So at the start of the sex act, the man wears the condom from the tip of the penis to the base of the organ and he uses this the whole time until the end of the sex act wherein the man ejaculates. And after this, he removes his organ, he removes the condom carefully, making sure the fluid does not spill. He seals the open end of the condom, sealing the fluid and throwing the condom away. So you have to be careful because it just takes one wrong sex act to get HIV, okay? So guys, remember your ABCs, abstinence, be faithful, use a condom correctly, stay safe, and I'll see you again.